To import a microarray experiment, begin by selecting the Start Microarray Project Experiment Type from the Welcome screen. This will open the Add Experiments to Import dialog. ArraySTAR supports a variety of microarray files, including Affymetrix, Nimblegen, Illumina, and Agilent, as well as any user-defined delimited text file. To load files, simply click Add File, Add Folder, or Import from ArraySTAR Project. After loading your files, ArraySTAR automatically attempts to detect the data scale of each imported array. By clicking the drop-down arrow in the Data Scale column, you can change the data scale for individual or multiple experiments between the linear, log2, and log10 options. In cases where the data scale is certain, as with cell and chip files, the ability to change this field is disabled. After importing the microarray data, you can select the normalization method in the Setup Preprocessing step. Select both the normalization method and the preprocessing parameters. If ArraySTAR can confirm that this data has already been normalized, then this step will be skipped. You can create replicate sets in ArraySTAR in a variety of different ways. One option is to select Create Replicate Sets from Attribute. Here, replicate sets are created based on the grouping shown for the selected attribute. You can also select Create Replicate Sets by Name Pattern, where the set is created based on a part of the chip name. Simply highlight the portion of the chip name that you wish to group by. All proposed replicate sets will be shown in alternating colors. Finally, you can choose not to create replicate sets at this time. You can still create replicate sets at a later time from the Experiment List view. For this particular example, we will create replicate sets based on name pattern. You can then import annotation files into your project by either downloading annotations for your Affymetrics data through your Netafix account, or by adding any local annotation files you have saved on your computer. Click Finish to load your data into ArraySTAR. From the Experiment List view, you can also create replicate sets by clicking on the Regroup Replicates by Name or Attribute tool, or by manually placing your data into replicate sets through the Create New Replicate Set tool. After naming your set, you can then drag and drop data into your set to complete it. Finally, you can compare replicate sets and use ArraySTAR's statistics tools to identify genes of interest within the various ArraySTAR views. For example, in the scatter plot, you can show one replicate set on each axis, and then select genes at various confidence levels or fold changes. To learn more about importing microarrays and creating replicate sets in ArraySTAR, or for information about any of our other products, please visit our website at www.dnastar.com or contact us at support at dnastar.com.